Why is the U.S.-India partnership the most consequential relationship of this century? Well, one big reason, prosperity. The United States is proud to be India's largest trading partner. And since 2001, our two-way trade has grown tenfold, reaching almost $200 billion a year. And our trade and investments, well, they create jobs. Today, there are 2,000 U.S. companies here in India directly employing more than 3 million Indians, while opening opportunities for U.S. consumers and workers as well. And just last month, top U.S. pension fund executives controlling over $1.5 trillion came here to India to explore how U.S. institutions can make those long-term investments in India that deliver returns for Americans and results for Indians. You see, prosperity, it's a two-way street. It's not just about the U.S. investing in India. It's about our countries investing in each other and in our people so that together we are working towards a more prosperous future for all. And this means working with our partners to advance women's economic participation, security, and entrepreneurship, from launching Academy for Women Entrepreneur programs across India or initiating the first U.S.-India Alliance for Women's Economic Empowerment. And through our U.S.-India partnerships, we're also confronting the greatest threat to our shared prosperity, climate change. These important collaborations are not just about reducing emissions, they're about creating the well-paying green jobs that will employ millions and millions of Indians and Americans in the near future. These efforts will not only help us achieve climate goals, but also position our countries as innovation and manufacturing hubs for cutting-edge green technology solutions, show the world how two major economies can collaborate for the betterment of our planet. And innovations in technology and manufacturing are also emerging from our deepening defense industrial cooperation. We saw this just a few weeks ago in Silicon Valley at the third Indus X Summit. We saw growing partnerships between U.S. and Indian defense companies of all sizes, as well as investors and universities. My friends, there's still so much potential to unlock as we continue to reduce barriers to trade and work together across all domains to create a free, open, resilient, and prosperous future as well as a technology corridor between the United States and India. So this month, we'll share more of those programs, initiatives, partnerships, and opportunities that drive shared prosperity for India, the United States, our partners in the region, and for the entire world. And how these partnerships for prosperity, for peace, for people, and for our planet help make the U.S.-India relationship the most consequential relationship of our century.